Hi guys and welcome to this video. Today I'm going to show you how to set up a script on your Mac to do several things. Now I just wanted to talk about something first and that's the fact that the shift in mentality on the, on the way that I'm going to be doing my videos. I'm going to be focusing more on development as opposed to software applications but I am going to be answering you guys' questions. Um, so, today we're just going to be um, doing a basic Apple script tutorial. And by the way, like the other design tutorial was for the web. We're not just going to be coding on the Mac. We're going to be doing the web and Windows. But today I'm just going to be basically showing you a Apple script tutorial. So, what you need to do is go up to Spotlight. And then search script editor and today I'm going to show you how to make a script to sync your iPod. So first of all we need to say open application and then we need to put in iTunes in quotation marks make sure to type it exactly as I have it shown here otherwise it will not work so it's un uncapitalized I and capitalized T and then we're going to say um, tell it's 17 application iTunes to update And then the name of your iPod. And mine's called Steve. So, um, just tuck that in there. And then we're gonna put a uh, close application. iTunes so very simple code there we're, we're telling it to open the application iTunes and then telling the Apple script to tell the application named iTunes to up the, update the device called Steve and then we're telling it to close the application iTunes so my iPod's not currently plugged in right now, um, but I'll I'll just show you part of the Apple script working. So I'm going to close out of iTunes here, and I'm going to click compile. And when all your text goes blue like that, it tells you that you've got it right. Next, what we're going to do is go to File, Save As, and then I'm going to make an, an app that says Sync My iPod, and then I, I recommend that you put it as an application and you also put it as a startup screen so that you can see when it's 
starting up and then and then hit save um we will now see that sync my ipod dot app has shown up on my desktop now my ipod not completely currently plugged in so i won't be able to show you all of this but you will be able to see that itunes opens The script is running. And then press run to run the script or quit to quit the script. So we're just going to click run and then you're going to see the iTunes will open. And then it's 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 opened iTunes, but it had a problem because my iPod wasn't plugged in. So that was a basic Apple script tutorial. Hope you've enjoyed and I hope you've learned something. Thanks for watching.